First of all, I'd like to thank you for being here to recognize exemplary women that are dedicated to making the 20th Assembly District a better place to live and work. We're honoring four outstanding women for the work they've done in the community. I'm very humbled, you know, and I really thank him for selecting me as one of the Women of the Year. When I first came to Union City, I found out there was no museum, and I thought, oh my God, history is gonna be lost. So I started working on it, and then, you know, in a few years, I was able to get it. With the help of the city, they gave me a building, which I lease, and it's now open for, I think, about 20 years now. My name's Penny Peck. I was kind enough to be honored as the education woman of our district for the year. Reading is everything. For 25 years, I was the children's librarian in the city of San Leandro, and since I retired, I volunteer at the public library. I'm also president of the school board, and of course, education, that's what we're all about. Pat Danielson, for many years, uh, an outstanding member of the Washington Township Hospital Board. Uh, that hospital is one of the best in the country. Uh, it's been recognized that in many ways and uh, she's had just many, many years of service, which we really appreciate. I'm very genuinely excited that we are honoring um, diverse voices and diverse um, people, and being a part of that means a lot to me, just because, um, you know, as the first African-American woman elected to public office in the United States, um, it just shows the diversity of this country, the beauty of the fact that we, we can come from all different backgrounds, look very much different, have different opinions, and still respect each other and honor each other for our differences and also just move the community together as Americans. I know her best for the many years where she's been active in the Afghan community. Uh, helping seniors and others adjust to life here. She's also a leader in uh, the women's movement. She's asked to give speeches all around the Bay Area and now of course has just been elected to the Hayward City Council. I just want to say thank you so much and we are very much stronger together so thank you.